The song Don't Rush In. Um, I wrote that quite a few years ago, um, but never ever liked the production on it. I recorded it at a studio in Epsom, and the production didn't come out the way I wanted it. It was a bit flat, it never had the rock and roll feel to it. It's sound. It didn't have the rock and roll vibe at all to it. Um, so, earlier on in the year, I started working on the backing track to it again. Just starting with the cue stick, adding the drums, bass, some keyboards, uh, some of the keyboard, piano, uh, bass, and um, it came out really well. I re recorded it and I was really happy with the production. The story behind Don't Rush In, how I wrote that, was me and my cousin was playing the guitar and playing a bit, playing a few songs, a few rock and roll, a few Elvis songs, and he was in himself at the time, he was going through a, a bit of a relationship crisis with a girl he was seeing at the time, and he was serious, but she didn't seem all that serious. And the girl kept messing him around and wasn't showing that, that, that much of interest in him. So I said to him, don't rush in to things. Make sure she's the one that's meant to be. Take your love slowly. Don't, don't rush in. Make sure that's meant to be. Make sure you, you really love her and find out each other's ways first before you go rushing in and ended up, she ended up breaking you up. And he was playing a uh, I think it was his latest flame by Elvis. And the tune was ding da ding da ding da ding da ding. So I thought, I looked at him, he looked at me, I said, Give me a pen and paper. I started writing, and then there I did, don't rush in. <laughs> <laughs> 